Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome back to the channel. Man Life the Black Pearl, Benjamin living his best life. How we all doing? I hope everyone is well. It's a good day today. You know, it's back to work after a wonderful weekend. Guys, I had such a great time stealth camping up at the ski resort. I'm telling you, that was an amazing experience. Guys, yes, it was cold. Yes, it was cold. It was all of that. But it was an amazing experience I got a chance to experience in my lifetime. And that is what I'm so really grateful about. So I recorded one night and then like the next day, rest of that, I took that for that, like that's that me thing, period, you know, but I still, I had a great time. Kind of wandered around a little, slept a lot, wandered around a little, this, that, and the other, but I had a great time up in that area between the two places. So, you know, again, Jiminy Peak, the uh, ski resort, you know, here in Hancock, Massachusetts, very nice place, guys. And next to it is the Wyndham Bentley. It's a ski resort. And they're open and they, uh, it's just, oh my gosh, you guys should see it. That's all I can say. So I had a great time. So like the weekend is over. It's back to workflow. I had to go to work today. You know, Monday is always a little rough because you got to get back in the swing of things. Um, and nevertheless, I did it. So, which bring me to this van. So me and this van has been out <laughs> enjoying ourselves and it's back here and she is dirty the van is filthy and um i just for the sake i wanted to see something can i do this i can yes go to the gas station but i bought our vacuum cleaner out of the house right and i want to see if i can vacuum this van with my uh power station just for kicks and giggles, you know, just to see if that'll work, if it's possible, you know? So let me get this thing set up and let's see if we could vacuum this whole van, right? With the uh, vacuum cleaner in the power station. Matter of fact, let me see if I can get boss lady to come downstairs and be the camera person. Hang on one second. Okay guys, she said no. Nah. <laughs> It's too cold for her, so I'm gonna get the tripod set up and mount this. Let's see if we can vacuum this van using the abyssal. What is that? Power track. Yada yada. It's the vacuum from in the house. <laughs> and the power source again. The Alpha is ESS 1036 watt, 2000 maximum peak so i don't know what the voltage is for the vacuum cleaner but we're gonna find out because if it's not enough it's just gonna say it's not enough but if it's enough we're gonna vacuum this van so let's get that started okay guys so i got it hooked up to the system this van is dirty the salt and the ice and stuff from the last few days it's been a mess so this is what we're working with. I still got some stuff to throw away. I put the bed back together uh, early this morning, but that's about all I did. So to get this here cleaned up. needs to go back in the back. Move your back a little bit. Put this back in the truck. Cable management, though. This sleeping bag I always leave here in the front, in the front seat. Yeah, the trips and going places, going camping, and everything. Oh yeah, that's all fine. Then you gotta come back home, or whatever. 
when you do, you got to clean whatever it is you're using. Put it away nicely. This little broom I usually use, uh, honestly, but today I'm gonna try to vacuum clean it with the uh, power supply. Let's see if it could work. Come on in. And, uh, let's step, push the button, and see if it comes on, and see what happens. Okay. <laughs> That's cool. Let's see. Five hundred and eighty-eight. Five hundred and eighty-eight watts is pulling. So let's see, is it enough for me to be able to vacuum? This van without running out too much power. All right. Oh yeah, I got good suction and everything. Good so I want to do the front first. It seemed to be easiest. So let me let me readjust uh, this. Hey, what's going on, man? How you doing? I don't know. Let me see the ticket up in the seat. <laughs> I'm trying to get to the floor, so let's see what happens, y'all. I'm surprised it worked. I, I really am. Let's see how long. Now that right there ain't bad because nobody sits up here anyway, okay? But it looked better than it did. One or two little white dingy dingies. I'll get it with the broom later. You know? I'll probably end up going to the car wash anyway. I just needed to touch that, y'all. All right, so this is a bowl that needs to go upstairs. Now, you can see what I'm looking at. That's what it is when you live in these winter regions and they got the salt everywhere. It's like every time you get out, you walk on the salt, no matter where you at, they don't put down on the snow. They don't put down salt and you put it on your shoe and you get in and out of here. This is an endless task right here. So I'm gonna see if I can make a tilt. Oh yeah, like you're in the house. Will it work? I got this carpet in here, you know? Right. Now I'm letting it sit there 
and use that to get all that other stuff with. Look at that. Major difference. I gotta get these little cracks, and, these little nooks and crannies. But that worked pretty well so far. I mean, 90%, and we're pulling five, 572, 572 watts. I got up in there, y'all. <laughs> I got up in there. That's what's up. Now that, 100% better. Although I'm gonna go to car wash anyway. I just wanted to test my power station. You know, the other night, uh, the other day it did real well. The only fallback was recharging it from the car. Um, I should have went in one of the establishments or something, but I didn't. I just let the car run and let it recharge the unit for the next night. To use my that e-blanket, electric blanket. So that was a success, you know. You know, it wasn't like I was in Las Vegas or anything. It was cold inside the van. But laying on top of that electric blanket and then my zero degree sleeping bag. And then I had this here on. Guys, this thing here is amazing, of course. Uh, my pullover hat. I was quite comfortable, y'all. Quite comfortable. Man. Let's get over to the other side. Yeah. Now, y'all know, this be the side. This is where you get in and out of it. Lord have mercy. That's all them adventures, y'all. Tell you what, I do it all over again when I can. Let's see if I can get that hose to reach around here. Some kind of way. Alright, uh, yeah, so I laid it across the seat, but I need to get to this hose right here. I'm gonna lay it across the seat. This is just Benjamin, they got nothing to do today, y'all. 
That front seat always filthy. Look at that. when you cook or when the weather gets hot. Real cool idea. I saw that on our YouTube, YouTube University. That's it. The front, I'm gonna wipe that off and stuff when I... That's better. Umbrella. It's all broken up. But I tell you what, if it's raining, you wish you had one. There you go. Tuck the way back in there. Time to get some new floor mats. And that's that for now. check out a to see how much voltage we've used up to use the house vacuum <laughs> to vacuum the van out I mean this is my second home here so I gotta keep it right you know I want nothing shabby my, my house my little apartment my itty bitty apartment ain't, ain't shabby I ain't shabby and my van ain't shabby. So let's check it out. Where we at? Oh, I turned it off. Oh, so it ran it down to 73%. It was at 100. How long did that take? Hey, even though I clipped the video a little, I don't know, about 40 minutes. So that ain't bad. It's still 73% available. You know, and I vacuumed the whole, the whole thing. Oh, my hands are so white all right so here we go let's take that take a look at this a little better clean some of this stuff out all right 
keeps falling off. I don't know where the battery and the cover at. I gotta find it. Yeah, stuff moves, so. I got some Velcro and Velcroed a lot of things down. So that, you know how you, you jump in and you take off sometime and you forget that one or two things? That one or two things will let you know you forgot it. As soon as you make a right or left turn, we'll have to stop real short. Yep, they'll let you know. They'll let you know that what's up. So listen, guys, I am not going to hold you up. Um, you guys, thanks again for watching the journey. Thanks for help back in the van with me. Guys, I don't know. I'm not, uh, this is not a paid endorsement or anything, but, you know, this power station works very well, Black Friday deal. This powerful ESX, oh, 1,000 watt power station. So it took care of me for two nights during the camper trips. If you missed the video, guys, go back and check out the video. You know, stealth camping in the ski resorts. Like, minus two degrees, you know, camping and cooking. You know, right there. Go check that video out, guys. And uh, you'll see, you just see a little bit more about what goes on with Van Life for Black Curl, you know. So this is back to Monday. It's back to work, workflow. So uh, that's it for now. And like guys, again, remember, not only am, not only am I, but you are a star too. And you shine so bright. Live your very best life, guys. Like keep your space clean, you know. Keep your space clean. I mean, this is. Again, like I'm saying, I just want to test the system, and I'm surprised that it worked for as long as it did, but it did. And there's a lot of juice left on there, so I'm happy about that. That's what this was about. So you guys have a great day. Remember, man, like the black curl here, live your very best life, okay? If nobody tell you they love you today, I do, and you have a great day. Until my next video, you guys, shalom. All right, y'all, so she's all cleaned up and put back almost to the way I like her. <laughs> yeah, that's my baby, you know, so I got to use her for work this week to get back and forth. Listen, guys, this weekend was amazing. Not only did I do the ski resort, but my, my brother, under the radar, guys, from under the radar van life on YouTube, guys, he was in town. He called me. He swung by. He came by the house. We spent a couple hours together upstairs in the house, man. Just relaxing and my hands are, I don't want to put, I need some lotion. But uh, yeah, we was just had a great time. We had a great time. Man, appreciate you coming through, Matt, man. You know, every time you in the neck of woods, you more than welcome. My house is your house, man. My house is your house. Mi casa es su casa. That's right. So we hung out a little while. We watched some videos and like he just came back, um, his video is from coming back from traveling to like Utah and out that way, guys. Check them out under the radar on YouTube. Guys, it does some amazing content. When you say landscapes and mountainous regions and things like that, guys, he he did an amazing job this year. So he just got back and first person he hooked up with on his way through town was me. Again, we spun some time together and I'm real grateful for that. So. And we're going to go ahead on and end this video. I will see you guys soon. Oh, yeah, boss lady. <laughs> I'm almost forget. <laughs> She's going to kick me. Yeah, so me and her went out last night. Traveled uh, two over to New York to the casino. She want, The boss lady likes to go to the casino. So she lets me do my thing. So I got to support her, too. So we ran out there to the casino. Hung out there for a little while. She did all right. Made her 2 $3. You know, came on back home. I got up this morning went to work. Like I said, it's time for me to take care of my second home now. You know, clean my van. She's gassed up. I'm uh, debating on taking it to the car wash, so we got some more snow coming in tonight for like the next day and a half. So other than that, guys, listen, I'm not going to bore you. I don't want to hold you up. You guys have a great day. Remember, you're a star. You sound so bright. Live your very best life. Uh, okay? Be good to someone today. Be quiet in the room. Just chill, you know, just chill. Yeah. All right. Y'all have a great day.